Hi guys, it's Andy from Nismo Tech back again with another quick view video. This time we're going to be taking a look at the Fnatic Gear Clutch G1 Gaming Optical Mouse. Obviously, as you're probably aware, Fnatic are one of the leading esports team in the world at this moment in time, uh, and this mouse um, has obviously you know had their influence on there. Um, so it's going to be pretty basic looking at the, the image that you've got on here um, there's not really much customizable in terms of RGB or anything like that but it is aimed towards the professional gamer so uh, on either side uh, of the mouse the internal component components you've got Omron switches which again are renowned as being the best and you've also got a Pixar 3310 uh, sensor inside which can go up to 5000 DPI um, you got up to 6500 FPS um, 30G acceleration I believe it comes in at just over 115 grams so it's quite a heavy mouse so um, let's go and have a quick little look around obviously you can see that I've been using it quite a bit with the fingerprints that are on there um, like I said it is very plain and very basic looking so RGB wise you have got an option to change the RGB colouring uh, in the scroll wheel that's the only place that you'll find any lighting uh, that you can change anyway um, so you've got that option of changing that I'll see your finger will be overlapped most of the time so you probably hardly ever see it um, you've got a couple of round buttons at the top here which I actually really do like very easy to find and nice and easy to press you've got the on run switches in there as well fantastic uh, and then you've got a couple of additional um, shoulder buttons on here as well which obviously you can customize on the bottom you can see we've got a couple of slide or mouse sliders or glide feet whatever you want to call them down there um, and then obviously you've got that sensor that pixart sensor in the middle as well so it is pretty basic looking um, the only other leds that you've got are up at the top here um, so you've got three white leds up there that will tell you what profile you want so you've got three profile options within software and you've got three options in terms of changing the uh, dpi which again you can customize in the software got a nice braided black cable you're going into a gold plated USB connector on the back there as well um, but in terms of comfort absolutely fantastic fits my hand really nicely I personally quite like a heavy mouse so for me it works very well and hopefully you can see if I turn that a little bit it just absolutely brilliant so the build quality on this is fantastic as you would expect from the leading esports team um, it's got kind of like a soft rubberized finish up at the top here uh, and all the way around the mouse but apart from that it does look very very plain but that was intentional so um, I've been using it for quite some time now in um, for a couple of weeks gaming Titanfall Far Cry um, a couple of other games on there as well um, and it just feels really really good the difference the armor on switch is made to gaming are, are sort of worlds apart compared to sort of cheaper gaming mice um, this mouse is coming in um, I found out on Amazon recently for uh, 39.99 um, I think it normally retails at just over 50 uh, so if you can get this on a, on a good price on a good deal um, I would very very highly recommend it um, certainly for 50 quid I wouldn't hesitate in buying this mouse uh, for myself um, it just performs very nicely so the only thing that I, I didn't quite like about it was the fact that the scroll wheel up at the top is rather loose um, but certainly that didn't hinder me when I was gaming um, and I certainly got used to it so for now uh, this is the, the quick view video on the Fnatic Gear Clutch G1 there is a full review down below where I'll be showing off more of the software um, talking to you about the customization showing you the color options etc uh, so do go and check that out uh, that will also be available on the website nismotech.com additionally down below you'll find links to where you can go and find out the latest price on this mouse and availability um, but i hope you did like the video if you did please go and check out the full review leave me a like and a comment and also share that will be uh, very much appreciated but i look forward to seeing you in my next video